evening and welcome to the Fullerton Union High School Showcase. I am Brittany Fischelli, I am a senior, and I am in the Academy of the Arts as a triple threat performer. I am involved in Thespians, Drama Club, Tri-M, NHSBA, and Comedy Sports. We are so glad you have come to join us and learn about all the wonderful things that Fullerton has to offer. We will highlight all the different programs that are unique to Fullerton and provide you with the reasons why you should join the tribe. I will be your host alongside with my friends Donnie Kennedy and Karina Hunt. Hi, I'm Donnie and I'm a sophomore. I'm currently in FUHS's Triple Threat program, meaning that I take choir, theater, and dance all at the same time to get a special diploma when I graduate. I hope you guys are excited to learn about all the wonderful programs we have here at FUHS. Hi, I'm Karina and I'm a senior and I'm also a Triple Threat performer. I'm also involved in comedy sports, thespians, and drama club. We hope you enjoy learning about Fullerton Union High School, where we are instrumental music, theater, avid. We are ag. We are dance, culinary, speech and debate, the vocal music program. We are the arts. We are Fullerton. First things first, we would like to introduce you to our principal, Mrs. Rubio. Welcome. My name is Laura Rubio, and I'm the proud principal of Fullerton Union High School. We hope that tonight you get an opportunity to see all of our amazing programs and you choose Fullerton for the education of your student. This is a historic campus. We opened in 1893. We have a long-standing tradition of educational success and opportunities for our students. Our campus is a historic campus with buildings that date back to the 1920s. Our campus is one of the most beautiful campuses in Orange County. It is the second oldest school in the county, so we're very proud of its history and tradition. Our historic tree, for example, here in the middle of our quad, was planted in 1914 by the senior class, and it still stands strong today. It is one of the key features and beauties here on our campus. We have our auditorium that was built in 1930, and still to this day is one of the most beautiful auditoriums in the city, and if not in the county. Our school offers a wide range of opportunities for our students to explore their passions, their interests, and they get a chance to be ready for a future beyond Fullerton. They not only attend top universities here in California, but across our nation. We hope that you're able to see that and that you choose Fullerton. We're very proud of our school community, very proud to be part of this city. We are Fullerton. Thank you, Ms. Rubio. Now, one of our beloved guidance counselors, Mr. McIntosh, will share a bit more about the counseling here at Fullerton. Well, hello and welcome to Fullerton High School. My name is David McIntosh. I'm the lead counselor here at Fullerton High School. Fullerton has four counselors. In addition to myself, Mrs. DeFreeze, Mrs. McCarthy, and Mrs. Kim are here to help you with whatever you need. The main focus of counseling is academic and social-emotional help. We will see your students at least two to three times a year scheduled, and then we are available multiple other times to see them. We have an open door policy that we keep so that kids can drop by and see us whenever they want, and parents are welcome to make appointments with us. Another part of the guidance department is the College and Career Center. Mrs. Dorado and Mrs. Conde are involved in keeping you on track for your college plans and your career plans. Both of them are very experienced in helping you find scholarships and uh, college opportunities and career opportunities. We work together closely with the, the College and Career Center. The ladies uh, have a yearly career unit that they will have with all of you so that you get the best possible information that you can. One of the main things at Fullerton that sets us apart is our programs and our clubs. And the counselors and the Career Center will help you to get involved and to become part of Fullerton. Becoming involved is the best way to ensure that you feel successful and that you are successful. I have a lot of experience with getting involved here at Fullerton High School, not only as a staff member, but also as a student. I attended Fullerton High School and I was involved with water polo, basketball, and swimming and was also still able to be successful in my classes. It was a great way for me to meet people and to form some lasting relationships. Hopefully this has been helpful to you and informative, and I look forward to seeing you in the future. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. McIntosh. The arts are very important to our culture here at Fullerton. This is the MSA building, where all the magic is created.
now, let's hear from two performing arts students, Samantha and Brittany, to learn more about our amazing programs. Hi, I'm Brittany Fischelli, and I am a part of the Academy of the Arts as a Triple Threat, and welcome to the Little Theater. Our theater department at Fullerton Union High School is absolutely amazing and gives you so many opportunities as an award-winning program. You can be involved in numerous shows, award shows, and festivals. You can audition for our improv comedy sports team and be a part of our Cappy's Critics team and be inducted and involved in the Thespian Honor Society. Being involved in the Thespian Honor Society, you can help out in the community and come up with fun ways to show off your artistic skills as well as being able to go to the International Thespian Festival at the end of your junior year, auditioning for colleges and getting callbacks, which starts your incredible college journey. Also in our theater department, there are different level of theater classes where you can gain your skills in theater as a performance and also as tech. The Fullerton Union High School's theater department is awesome and I am so glad to be a part of it. And remember, we are theater, we are the arts. Hi, my name is Samantha Dennis and we are in the Instrumental Music Room. In the Instrumental Music Program at FUHS, we have a myriad of performing ensembles offered. We have the Marching Band and Color Guard, we have the Jazz Ensemble, the Concert Band, Percussion Ensemble, and also the Winter Guard. As for non-performing classes, we have the Piano Class, Guitar Class, and AP Music Theory Class. We also offer Academy of the Arts Pathways, including Instrumental Music, Jazz Studies, and general music. We also have our Tri-M Music Honor Society, which is an honors club offered to all music students that encourages music awareness in our school. Throughout the year, we put on many concerts and we also participate in festivals and competitions. And remember, we are instrumental music and we are the arts. We are now in the vocal music room. The choir program offers four different choirs, including treble chorus, treble ensemble, bass chorus ensemble, and vocal ensemble. Choir students can also be in Tri-M as a part of the Honors Society. And we offer one academy pathway, the vocal performance pathway. And our program also hosts multiple festivals throughout the year, and we participate in competitions as well both solo and vocal, and we offer three concerts during the year. Personally, I have been in vocal ensemble for the past three years, and I am also the choral program president, and we offer many leadership opportunities in our program. I'm also in the AP Music Theory class, and I have greatly enjoyed diving deeper into music these past few years. And remember, we are the vocal music program, and we are the arts. We are now in the dance studio. In the dance department, we have four classes, beginning, intermediate, advanced, and dance production, having two concerts throughout the year and participating in workshops. For example, the audition workshop at the Disneyland Resort. For me personally, I've been a part of dance production for four years, dancing in the dance concerts, as well as football games, basketball games, soccer games, and even wrestling matches, and also participating in the workshops. We have our National Honor Society for Dance Arts, which is an honors level club that is offered to all dance students at Fullerton. I'm currently the co-costume manager for the dance program, which means I organize all of the costumes and hand them out for each of our concerts. Working with our dance director for the past few years has been incredible, and she's taught me so much about choreography, about dance, and just about how to perform in general. And remember, we are dance and we are the arts. Thank you, Samantha and Brittany, for peeking into what the performing arts at Fullerton have to offer. But not only do we have stellar performing arts classes, our visual arts classes shine as well. Here, Ms. Crail will show us what the visual arts at Fullerton have to offer. My name is Maggie Crail, and I'm the visual arts department chair for Fullerton Union High School. Right now, we are in my classroom, and this room is one of the many that we have for our large visual arts program, where we teach drawing and painting, 3D design, photography, both film and digital. We really work hard on having our kids learn about the conceptual as well as the technical side of art so that they are ready for their academic and or career endeavors. So for sure, one of the benefits of coming to Fullerton High School is the state-of-the-art classrooms that we have. So we, I, we were just in our digital lab where we had our studio lights and our, uh, we have digital SLR cameras and computers with Photoshop and Lightroom for students to use. 
But here, this is our wet lab. So we'll teach you analog film, how to make your own prints and all that. So come on in here and I'll show you our dark room. So when you're processing your paper to make your prints, this would be the workspace you would utilize. We have 11 stations and this is an individual station here where you can make your prints. And then once you expose your, your photo paper to the light and your negative, you'd bring it down here to these trays where normally the, you would have your developer, your fix, your stop, and your wash bath. You would do this in the dark, except for the red lights, of course. Welcome to Gallery 201. This space is dedicated for all of our artists and we house around nine shows a year, starting with our alumni show. And so our alumni show, we have people coming from 1968 up until current times bringing in their work. Some of these people are professionals, professional photographers, professional artists, and others have just have a long life love of the arts and whatever field they're in, engineers, doctors, or whatever, they're still doing the arts. The other shows are all student driven and we come up with new themes every year. This year we did an ofrendas show and we're doing uh, an overlooked show which had to do with appropriation and art. So a definite strength here at Fullerton High School is that we provide a home or a niche for kids to come and pursue their artistic endeavors, be it in 3D, drawing and painting, or photography. We are the arts. Thank you Mrs. Crail for showcasing the visual arts program with us. If your creative energy is better expressed through cooking, then Fullerton Culinary Arts is the place for you. Two members of the Culinary Arts program, Alexis and Casey, will explore the details of this fine program with you. Welcome to our kitchen. Up here, we have our utensil rack for all small equipment that we'll use for our labs. Next up, we have our main station here where we'll finish off our production for our school events. And we also do our mise en place daily for the students doing the labs followed up by our walk-in refrigerator, uh, followed up uh, by our commercial uh, dish line that's found in any kitchen. These are the tables where each, two students will cook each and every single lab for their classmates. For continuing on the production side, these are our two big mixers that we use to make uh, a big amount of volume of whatever it may be. On this side of the kitchen, we have our three ranges that accommodate for these three uh, tables on this side and three salamanders additional to it. Followed up by our two blagettes in the back of the kitchen with our two steamers and our griddles. And on the other side of the kitchen here, we have our three other ranges with uh, refrigerators in the back for other purposes. And now I'll pass it off to my classmate Casey. She'll tell us more about the program. Hi, my name is Casey Kimoto, and I'm a senior youth here at Fullerton High School. Our four-year program, which is sponsored by the California Restaurant Association, has many benefits that students can take advantage of. Our students are able to receive many various certifications in this program, such as the California Food Handlers Card and the CRA Work Ready Permit, which students who are eligible can receive a scholarship to Cal Poly Pomona, and lastly, the Force and Training Certificate. We are also members of Skills USA, which is a student-run organization that helps teach others about leadership. In addition, the culinary program has an articulation agreement with Cypress Community College that offers free dual enrollment classes to any of our students. We have four different levels of the culinary program, culinary arts, culinary cuisine, restaurant one, and restaurant two. And the third and fourth courses are also A through G approved. I myself love to cook and my experience here has only furthered my interest in food industry and food science. Over the past four years, I've had so much fun and created many long-lasting friendships. It's been an amazing four years here at the culinary program. It's provided me with a great learning experience both in and outside of the classroom, whether it be our competitions or just our daily work. Thank you for coming to our kitchen. And remember, we are culinary. Thank you, Alexis and Casey, for sharing your knowledge about culinary arts. Now, for those passionate about special effects and film makeup, we have a special program unique to our school called BEAST. Now let's learn more about this program. Uh, BEAST is an acronym for Biology, Engineering, Arts, Science, and Technology. The students have to design and create from scratch uh, original machines that move like living creatures 
or replicate effects as seen in film or the theme park industry. It connects to so many different disciplines. So for instance, just like on our first project, we're looking at creating eyes and doing some facial sculpting which ties actually into uh, medical prosthetics and prosthetic work. So all those techniques could be utilized to create a, a movie monster, but it also helps people in their daily lives just um, that have been in accidents, that have lost an eye or a portion of their face, you know, return that life back to them. It was great to hear about how BEAST provides students with rare opportunities to tap into their creative side. But agriculture is another program Fullerton has to offer. Currently, I'm on the softball field, but Hunter is down at the farm and he'll share more about what that program has to offer. Hi, my name's Hunter. Welcome to the Fullerton FFA Ag Department. As an incoming freshman, you'll be learning Ag Biology. In the classroom, you'll be doing labs and learning about the animals that we have on the farm. To my left is the greenhouse, where we grow fruits, vegetables, and other crops. And then behind that are the two animal barns. In the left barn, we raise pigs, goats, and lambs. And in the right barn, we raise the steers. I'm now going to pass it off to my classmate, Layla, who's going to talk to you about FFA leadership and conferences. Hi, my name is Layla, and I'm a sophomore in my second year of the Fullerton FFA. When you become an ag student, you also join the FFA, and it's the largest youth leadership organization. It has been around since 1928, and this jacket represents its history. What I like about the FFA is how I've met so many new friends at the public speaking contests, the field trips, and the leadership conferences. And now Hunter is going to tell us a little bit more about the animals. We are here in the steer barn. If you are interested in raising an animal, you can start out by raising a pig, lamb, or a goat. And then if you want to raise a steer, you can do that your second year. This is my steer. His name's Frog. I've enjoyed having him. He has taught me responsibility and how to take care of large animals. And if you're not interested in raising an animal, there's other opportunities such as growing crops like fruits and vegetables, but I highly recommend that you raise an animal. And if you don't like it your first year, you can just switch those other opportunities. So if being in the Ag program is something you'd be interested in, come join us at the Fullerton FFA. And remember, we are Ag. Thank you, Layla, for that glimpse into life on the Fullerton farm. For students looking for a tight-knit family and support on their path to college, we are proud to offer our AVID program. Mrs. Bravo Fullman and Benjamin will give us a closer look on what AVID is all about. Hi, my name is Miss Bravo Fullman and I'm the AVID coordinator here at Fullerton High School. We are incredibly fortunate here at Fullerton High School to have such a large AVID program. AVID stands for Advancement via Individual Determination. And that individual determination component is really what we hone in on. Because it doesn't matter your background, we wanna help make sure that you are successful. So AVID is for that student who wants to be successful and who wants to go to college. Our major goal is to close the achievement gap amongst our students. You do not need to have a 4.0 to join our program. We're actually looking for that 2.5, 3.0, 3.5 student so we can teach you some skills and some AVID strategies that are going to help you be more successful in not just high school, but also in college because AVID isn't not just for that student who wants to be successful, but it's for that student who wants to go to college. So I'm gonna go ahead and have a student introduce himself and teach you a little bit about why he joined our program. Hey, my name is Benjamin Lozada and I'm an AVID senior representative. Now, one massive AVID strategy are the AVID tutorials. AVID tutorials take place every Tuesdays and Thursdays and they serve as a collaborative tutoring session where students present their point of confusion and they present where exactly they're lost in in their class. And it's a really good opportunity because it allows students to work together to solve that problem and gain a better understanding of it. And another big AVID strategy are the AVID note taking and the focus notes. Focus notes play a large role in AVID because it allows students to go deeper into their notes and really learn about them and digest what the teacher is trying to teach them. And it serves as a great opportunity because it allows them to take advantage of the things in front of them. So if you have any questions about AVID, please reach out, check our school website, visit clubs and organizations to see AVID. And remember, it's not about your background or where you come from. Our goal is to help get you to where you're going. AVID has 
opened up many doors for me. And as a result, I was able to learn to take advantage of all the opportunities placed in front of me. And I was able to learn how to, you know, make the most out of my time and what I have. And remember, we are AVID. Thank you, Mrs. Bravo, Fulman, and Ben. We know so many students who benefit from AVID and we are so proud to offer it here at Fullerton. Another aspect of our academics is our APIB programs. To tell us a little bit more about APIB, here's an APIB student herself, Gabby. Hi, I'm Gabrielle. I've been a member of the Fullerton Honors Program for four years now, and I'm a full IB diploma candidate. I have found the Fullerton Honors Program to be an incredibly supportive community. When you come to a teacher and you tell them that you're interested in a certain topic for a term paper, they come back to you and they are so incredibly excited for you and they have a ton of research for you to work with. I've also found the student community to be incredibly cooperative um, and compassionate towards one another. And it's because of this that I feel comfortable enough to participate in multiple other activities that our school offers, like the speech program, the tennis team, and the NHS uh, CSF club. And it's also because of the Fullerton Honors Program that I feel comfortable applying to schools like Georgetown or USC or NYU, because I know that the curriculum that the school offers is preparing me aptly for those schools um, and for the type of education that they offer. So if IB sounds like the kind of thing that you're interested in, um, come to Fullerton, because we are proud to be an IB school. Thank you, Gabby. But while you're at it, why don't you tell us about another program you're proud to be a part of, the Fullerton Speech and Debate Team. Hi, it's me again, Gabrielle. I'm so incredibly excited to be talking to you about the Fullerton Speech Program because as president of the team um, and a member for four years, I know firsthand just how beneficial this program is. Because of the Fullerton Speech Team, I've had the opportunity to compete on a national and local level and take home just a few trophies. But I also know that regardless of how many trophies you win and awards you gain, um, the Fullerton Speech Program is an incredibly valuable experience. Our program is designed to help kids that are maybe a little bit cautious about public speaking find their voice and use their voice in a meaningful and productive manner. So if that's something that interests you, I encourage you, come to Fullerton because we are Speech and Debate. Thank you again, Gabby. You are an excellent example of how involved Fullerton students can be with all that we have to offer. We are also proud to have a JROTC program for all those students who are interested in the military. The JROTC cadets are going to share with us what makes this program so special. Hello, welcome. I am Cadet Lieutenant Colonel Valencia Rojas. I am this year's battalion commander and I am representing Fullerton Unit High School Junior Reserves Officer Training Corps, also known as JRTC, that was founded in the National Defense Act of 1916. The curriculum emphasizes the meaning of citizenship and focuses on leadership and character development. JRTC is also famous for teaching the leadership theory and applying it with leadership experience that becomes progressively more demanding and challenging as cadets make rank and mature as talented and effective leaders. Personally, in my experience over the last four years, I have learned that discipline will set you free and take on your responsibilities first before you do anything else. When I live this way, I am a lot happier and less stressed out. Do you like that? Well, there's more where that came from. I'm James Salgado and I'm this year's Command Sergeant Major and a member of the drill team. Because JRTC bridges leadership theory with application, this connection allows JRTC to be approved for the G elective credit that is required if you plan to attend the Cal State University or University of California campus. Instead of taking PE, you can earn the same PE credit requirement by being a JRTC. Not only will you have fun, but you will learn to lead your team in Army boot camp style exercises. JROTC offers programs within our program that provide opportunities for fun, competition, and more leadership experience. Raiders compete in mud runs and competitions that include rope, rope bridges, running obstacles, courses, and survival swims. We also have air rifle marksmanship team that competes in the Junior Olympics. In 2018, our academic team won national tournament in Washington, D.C., beating 3,000 other teams across the nation. Our cybersecurity team reached platinum, which is the highest in the national competition. 
Our armed and unarmed competition drill and color guard can be seen winning drill meets and performing all over Orange County. This year we plan to take field trips to see the Reagan Library, the Midway in San Diego, and the Army National Training Center near Barstow. This summer we plan to go to Catalina Island and camp under the stars at Emerald Bay. There we will ride horses, go kayaking, zip lining, and hiking. We will also learn rifle and archery marksmanship, map reading, and we will negotiate high cope obstacle courses. All of these activities are designed to build a cadet's confidence and self-esteem. Although the JRTC program does not recruit for the military, cadets have no obligation to join the military. If you are interested in public service, jobs like police, firefighters, and federal agencies like the FBI, Homeland Security, and the DEA, then JRTC is a great place to start. Lastly, you should know that JRTC is like a second family. Here, once you're part of the Corps of Cadets at Fullerton, you're part of the team that will support and care for each other. This year, we will compete with all of our teams and you will make friendships that will last a lifetime. If you want to be part of a team that, that is driven, disciplined, and fired up to lead, compete, and win at competitions, school, and life, then consider an enroll in JRTC where cadets lead the way. Thank you, JRTC, for highlighting what your program has to offer. Now, last but not least, Fullerton Athletics has something for everyone. Down at the football field, Dr. Postema will give us the play-by-play -play about Fullerton Athletics. Welcome to Fullerton High School. My name is Dr. David Postema, and I'm the Athletic Director here at Fullerton High School, and it's my privilege to serve our students in this capacity. I want to talk to you about three things today regarding Fullerton High School Athletics. The first thing is the high expectations that we have for our students and our athletes. Certainly as students, we expect the very best in the classroom and we expect the very best behavior, but we also expect you to excel on the field, on the court, in the pool, wherever that may be. We expect you to do the things that are necessary to bring our programs to the very top of the league because we compete in a very competitive league. And so we expect the very best and our coaches are gonna give you the very best coaching that they possibly can for you to excel. Secondly, I'd like to talk to you about the facilities that we have here at Fullerton High School. Look at this beautiful place that, we're, that I'm standing right now. This is our high school soccer, football, track and field stadium. You can see the beautiful new turf that we have. Uh, it's only about three years old. The, the stadium was refurbished just recently. You can see the new locker rooms being built right behind me over here, right straight the other way. We have a brand new gym that's being built. It's gonna be finished uh, uh, by the end of the school year. Uh, we're scheduled to get a new pool in the next couple of years. We're also talking about uh, upgrading baseball, softball facilities, tennis courts, you name it. Everything is getting some attention here at Fullerton High School. And so not only do we expect the top and the very best out of you, but we're gonna give you the best facilities to meet those expectations. The last thing I'd like to talk to you about are three letters, IFL. IFL stands for Indian for Life. And Indian for Life represents a special bond, a special connection that Fullerton High School students, teachers, alum, we all have together with each other because we've been through this place. We've been to this wonderful school very old school, over 125 years, lots of graduates. There's just this special connection. You never know when you're gonna run into someone on the street or someone uh, at Disneyland or maybe someone halfway across the country that is a Fullerton High School grad. It's happened to me and it's a special experience because you have that immediate bond. And so that's another special thing that we have about Fullerton High School. So not only do we have high, expect high expectations for you, and for our sports, but we also have these great facilities and then we also have IFL. It's a special place to be. We hope you choose Fullerton High School. Thank you for watching and IFL. We hope you have enjoyed your evening tonight and had an opportunity to see our amazing award-winning program. We hope that you and your student join us in the fall and become part of our Fullerton family. And that leads us to the end of our journey through the greatness that is Fullerton. I am Fullerton. I am Fullerton. I am Fullerton. We, we are, are Fullerton. Fullerton. We are proud of all the prowess Fullerton. And we, like others, greatly bear. We will be thy loyal subjects ever. Joy and grief we alike will with thee 
Shay.